you ain't ever had a elk burger, let me tell you something. You missing out. Man! Look at that! So we're going to be blackening our uh, elk burgers here. So I got some blackening seasoning here, some Cajun spice. I put a little honey rub on there. You know, a couple of things I like. And now we're going to throw them on the, uh, the skillet here. And, uh, you know, we're going to cook them up. <laughs> uh, actually, this this is ain't a skillet. It's a, uh, I think they call it a griddle. I don't know. It just knows it's expensive. <laughs> so what we're going to do here... We gonna put them on the griddle thing, and and uh, you know this goes over two burners, so I, I don't know if the middle one's gonna cook as good. So, you know we probably gonna have to do a little bit of rotate. You know you, you got to know your own equipment, so whatever equipment you're working with, you got to do a little rotate, do a little rotate. You know, <laughs> whatever you gotta do. There we go. I kind of like to put them in a little triangle. You know just nice uniform everything ought to cook kind of uniform because you know all three sides is equal and everything so I'm going to start caramelizing some onions that's uh, another thing you're going to want to do caramelize some onions they all look something like this you know, just a little bit of butter oil on the pan with your sweet onions and a little bit of sugar now I'm going to use barbecue sauce. I'm going for a name brand barbecue sauce. Um, I didn't pick this one for any particular reason other than, well, it expired about eight months ago, so I got to use it up. <laughs> so I'm putting my barbecue sauce in there and kind of stir it around and everything. Yeah, put a little more in there. Just get it good and saucy. Don't be afraid to put a decent amount in there. Now what we're going to do is we're going to let it boil off. And uh, the whole thing here is, uh, you know, I want to get that moisture out of there. Now be careful not to burn it in the bottom of your pan. Just kind of get it to a light rolling boil and maybe simmer it a while. It's probably going to take about 20 minutes, maybe even 30 minutes. But what you try and do is get that moisture out of there and make it thicken up. Let's check in on our elk burgers here. Man, look at that. That looking good, ain't it? Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna toast our pretzel bun with some smoked cheddar cheese, American cheese, pile it on up. Oh man, look at that! You ever had a burger that good looking? Man, that elk burger, I tell you, it's healthy. It's like eating a steak. You ain't never had it. You gotta try it. Look at that, man! Look in the middle of that. That, that's how you want to do it right there. That, that's about 130 degrees, 135 degrees or so. And, uh, and then I, you know, I kind of wrap it in foil and let it sit a little bit while I was preparing everything else. Well, here we go. We're getting ready to eat our elk burger. Got that elk burger cooked medium on a pretzel bun, some smoked cheddar and American cheeses. And then we got the caramelized onion with, with barbecue sauce. Mmm. 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 Look at that. You see that? Man. That's the thing about an elk burger. I mean, it. it's kind of like eating a steak, you know? It's got some strong flavor. You never had an elk burger. It's It's got a lot of flavor. It's a little different. I, you know, I don't really know anything to compare it to except... You know, just a different kind of flavor, strong flavor, kind of tastes like a steak. Them onions pair up real good. It's not very, it's like cooked all the way through. That's called rare. It's supposed to be that way. I'm having some of my mac and cheese with it. Mmm. <laughs> So what do you think? It's pretty good. Pretty good, yeah. I, I think so too. So on a on a scale of 
point one to point five. Point five being like the best elk you ever had. Point one being, you know, not as good but still pretty awesome because it's my recipe. What do you think? Point one to point five. Point three one four. Point three one four. It's kind of in the middle there. I guess that ain't too bad. I mean, I I give it a point four, uh, maybe a point four or five, but um, <laughs> it's pretty good, I think. That barbecue sauce, that barbecue sauce paired up real nice. Man, that mac and cheese. Mm. Well. There you have it, folks. Black and Elk Burger. Uh, be sure to subscribe. Comments down in the comments. You know, tell, tell us what you think. Uh, you got anything else to say? No. We out of here.